welcome back to Diane's Kinky Coily Reality. My name is Diane. Welcome to my channel. <laughs> and don't forget to like, share, and hit that subscribe button if you guys want to keep on hearing my voice. If my voice is not too weird to you. Anyways, so guys, um, welcome back to my channel again. Today we're doing a food review. Um, I do have a food playlist on this channel. I haven't been updating it in a while. Now I decide to do it. Um, now, normally with these type of mukbang or food reviews, you would have to show your face. Unfortunately, I have a cold sore on my face and my face looks extremely ugly. So I will not be showing my face. But however, that does not mean it's going to take away anything from this food review. So let's do it. Alrighty, ladies and gentlemen let's get ready so our number one review is dawa chicken so dawa chicken is a korean store next to my house there are two of them there's resto mukja and there's dawa chicken dawa chicken is heavily renowned in my area for their amazing amazing korean fried chicken resto mukja more for their traditional korean dishes um Resto Mukja also has fried foods. However, their fried foods are not as good as Dawa chicken because Resto Mukja prepares everything in advance and they leave it out for people to buy during the day, which means by the time, you know, it could be a little stale, a little not that good. But their dishes, traditional Korean dishes are awesome. However, Dawa chicken make are like made to order. Like as soon as you make the order, they make it. So you could be waiting 30 to 25 to 30 minutes for their amazing chicken. Now, their chicken, even Gordon Ramsay cannot have the audacity to not give them five. All right, so first food that we will be reviewing is their amazing egg rolls. Now, let me tell you something about these egg rolls. Oh my gosh, always warm, always hot, delicious, beautiful. Let me help you hear that crunch. crunchy delicious 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 oh my goodness Now, the egg rolls always come with this complimentary, not egg rolls, sorry, vegetable spring rolls, always come with this complimentary sweet sauce. I have no idea the name of this sauce. I don't think it really matters. I think what really matters is how, ooh, how it tastes, so. Mm -hmm. Very good. I have no idea what's in it, but I don't think that really matters. All right, guys. So the main event. Da, da, da. Of course. Now, I will tell you straight up, my chopstick game is trash. So this is Sun Sao, Korean fried chicken. The real, the real KFC. My goodness. Beautiful, isn't she? And this is another version with their spicy sauce. This is another version with their spicy sauce. Uh, I took medium. There are lots of levels. If you want a spicy, spicy, you want a medium, not spicy at all. Extremely beautiful, well cooked, well seasoned extremely beautiful gorgeous hey, look at that delicious do y'all want to hear the crunch
So it comes with this mayonnaise-like sauce, extremely delicious. And when you dunk that in there, sis, sis, my goodness. Mm. Delicious. I also got me a little complimentary side. Onion rings. They look delicious. They look good. Ooh. And a little bit of this. Mm-mm. They gave me a lot. Jeez. <laughs> Mm. Now with every chicken you order, it comes with these little radish things i found the recipe online i used to throw them out not understanding what it was but the day i tried them says i never turn back they are so crispy it has like a pickle type it's in a brine that's almost like a pickle type brine but let me tell you these things are good super addictive little radish cube things they are so good super crunchy You will love these. They're to eat after, not during. After you finishing the chicken, you chow down on these. Now everybody knows Korean fried chicken, when you eat that, you gotta have some drinks. Not a drink, some drinks, sis. So sometimes my drink of, of choice would be these. Smirnoff Ice Encore Fusion. We got the peach mango. We got the pineapple coconut. We got the blueberry, raspberry, blackberry. Ooh, blue raspberry, blackberry, sorry. And then we have the berry blast, which is, uh, sorry, this part's in French. Citrus, blue raspberry, and cherry. Now, unfortunately, well, I wouldn't say unfortunately, but technically there are more flavors. There's sangria. There's a lot more flavors, a lot more. Now these are extremely delicious, extremely good. They taste awesome. Yes, they are 5% alcohol. Um, so if you can't hold your liquor, these are good. These are good for you. They're amazing, fantastic, and taste awesome. Music licensing reimagined. Now, y'all, you cannot have Korean fried chicken, a Korean dish, without the holy grail of all Korean food. Soju. Why did I take it? Because I saw Jimin drinking it in a BTS video, and I was like, if Jimin is drinking it, then I have to drink it too. So yeah, that's that. Bit. That's why I got it, because of Jimin. Now, this is weird because this is 17% alcohol. I don't drink alcohol. <laughs> I do not drink that level of alcohol, y'all. So, mm. yeah, I'm not sure about all that. Yeah, I ain't sure about all that. But I'm just gonna show y'all because I'm not drinking this. It's a little too late in the night. Like, it's too early. Like, I'm not drinking this right now, but I just want to show y'all. When you're eating Korean, not KFC, Korean fried chicken. Got to get you a bottle of soju. But, you know, I'm going to... I'm going to hang with my Smirnoff in the meantime. So, excuse you. 
I'm gonna chill with my Smirnoff in the meantime. Ooh, baby, this look, this look good. Bon appetit, y'all. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel. Bye. Music licensing reimagined.